but I've been not see you in my. <laughs> what am I about to get you in the bathroom if you already did one? They definitely got a lot of stretch to them. That is just the dumbest thing ever. I don't know what else to say. I'm gonna get this money for my brand as well as helping these other brands out. So. channel today's a video as you can see from the title i don't know what it is but you do so if you're new here my name is akira janae don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave so i don't know if this is going to be plugged into a vlog that i already like started or if this is going to be a new one but if so then there you go you got the intro so i have a lot of packages that i just got today one two three four five um i think that's all so this is other packages over here so i'm about to open these up um these are like a lot of like collabs and stuff like that and then stuff that i had already like ordered myself so i know what two of these are so i know this is a wig the other one is some perfume and then the fashion over one i did actually order this one that one wasn't actually sent to me this time so i'm gonna go ahead and get into this wig first so i can make sure it is what it's supposed to be. So, box cutter from Amazon. Whew, I just love getting out. I'm still waiting on four more packages as well. Um, I have like a furniture piece coming for a collab. I have some more G and stuff for a collaboration. And yeah, I, like I said, I don't know what most of these boxes are. So I'm not sure what I actually got and what I don't have. Oh, they changed their packaging again. This is cute. Stay tuned for the video. Okay. I thought y'all done stepped it up a little bit, girl. All right, so we got wig. We got, ooh, girl. Not they personalizing the comb in the edge brush to say love me. Okay, get with it. And don't mind the scrubs because, girl, I'm about to go to work today. <laughs> I literally got off last night, went to sleep at like 8.30, and then 8.30 this morning, and I've been waking up on and off because all of these packages have been getting delivered, so prints will automatically bark, then they'll knock on the door, then my ring doorbell will go off, so it, it just be a lot of a lot of hoopla going on. So I originally got up and just got up at like two o'clock. So then I had to go to my old apartment complex to get this fashion over order because when I ordered it, they had all of my old addresses on there and girl cannot get in contact with lso if y'all ever had something shipped with lso they ain't got no contact number they don't have customer service they, they don't have anything so literally it got delivered to my old apartment luckily i still know like the code and everything but i didn't have to use the code because they doing construction over there so the gate already opened i did call ahead to the little manager or whoever over there and he had texted the girl and she was like she'll look when she get home but baby i need my stuff so i already went over there and got it okay so this one is she in collab i got three things coming from them so i'm super excited um i get my hair done next monday i don't know what vlog that's gonna be in so i'll probably do this she in haul i gotta look at the date that these videos are due if they're due soon then i'm gonna put that wig on from love me and use it if not then i'm just gonna do the she in collapse next week and girl this purse definitely looked cheap it looked a lot better on the pictures because this ain't even real metal this is plastic but it, it looked cute online this was like a dollar or two dollars so i mean i guess you get what you pay for but i definitely thought that was gonna look a little bit better <laughs> so yeah i'm not gonna get into this clothing haul i'll probably post the whole she in video and stuff and then we'll get into it i do want to look at these shoes real quick though girl these look really nice and prince is like right here i bother me I don't have any green shoes. I am trying to have at least one color pair of heels, like in each color, just in case. So this is cute. I like it. And I got it in a size Euro 40, so hopefully I can fit it. It's just the kind that 
laces up, tie up around your leg. So yeah, I think these are gonna be so cute. Hopefully I can fit them. Sometimes I'll be sizing up like a half a size. If they don't got it, then I'll just stick with my size because I don't want no big old shoe. But I like to read the reviews, so we'll see. But yeah, I got a lot of clothes in here. So we're gonna put this one to the side. All right, so once she in, package down. This next one I'm gonna open is this box. I um, have no idea what this is, but I know it's clothes because on the invoice, they tell it all my business, talk about a woman two-piece pants set. So I want to say this is either Shein. If this is not Shein, then it's probably Lovely Wholesale. They did reach out to me for a collab as well. And I do plan on doing a YouTube ebook, so stay tuned for Black Friday on my actual website, AJB Beauty Collection. I also sell digital products, so... I'll be having a full YouTube ebook of explaining just all the questions that I get about YouTube, like starting a channel, collaborations, editing, like literally every single question that people just ask me about YouTube. Okay, yeah, so this is from Lovely Wholesale. They gave me a free baggie. So I'm not gonna pull any of these clothes out. I wanted to open these to make sure that I know what I got. So yeah, and then they sent, what is this? A bag and two markers, girl. One thing about these, companies over in China, they gonna pack some stuff down. <laughs> like, they gonna pack some stuff down, bro. So I hope I can fit this stuff. All right, so I got my lovely wholesale collab. I got the wig collab. Okay, Prince, you're gonna have to get down. Next one I'm gonna open is this one. I actually know what this is. I don't really know what video I'm gonna throw this in. This is perfume, hopefully these smell good. So they sent me three bottles of perfume and then they sent like three tester bottles of the same thing. They got this packaged really nicely. I saw this like honeycomb packaging online and I was thinking about getting it for my brand as well. Okay, so I have three big bottles of perfume and then they sent testers i'm not sure if it's the same thing or not so stay tuned for the vlog this is actually in and i'll talk about how they smell um i think this may be some type of vlog of like a week in the life of like you know another i think i did one of those week in the life of a content creator with the 6 to 6 p.m job so that's probably going to be something like this so this is going to be the behind, behind the scenes of all of this um, collaboration and stuff. So yeah, I'm not going to open these. I'm going to wait and y'all will see that in an actual different vlog. Last item that I got today that I had to go steal off my old <laughs> porch is my stuff from Fashion Nova. I am actually probably about to try this on because I need to know if this fit. And I'll be anticipating this. All right, so me and Bay have a photo shoot, a Christmas photo shoot coming up. I'll probably, I don't know, I'm going to record it, but I'm not sure if I'm going to post that in November or December because I have a plan for videos in December that I'm going to drop soon. So I got a dress and then I got a three-piece set. Three-piece set has been going viral for a while. Um, I'm going to go ahead and try... I'm going to try to dress on first, and then I'm going to try on this three-piece set. I'm not going to show y'all the dress, but I'll show y'all the three-piece set. Like, this set is so cute. Let me turn off. I'm not sure if y'all can really see. So I got the three-piece set from Fashion Nova. This is so cute. It comes with the little cardigan top and the pants. I got it in a size small because they were sold out of uh, dang everything else in this color, which I'm glad I got it in the small because baby, this thing is huge. I, I know, I think I sized down specifically because they said it was pretty big. So yeah, I'm 5'3", it goes all the way down. Pants still got a lot of stretch. I literally could have probably gotten an extra small. Top is good. Comes with two pockets. Super cute. I can't wait till my hair done to get the full effect because baby, this is just not giving. But this, too cute. And I'm like stepping on the cardigan right now as we speak. 10 out of 10, I definitely need this in every color. And I'm definitely going to be buying this in like the ivory cream white color along with the black color. So yeah, super cute. Definitely recommend. What time is it? It's 5.01. I'm about to take Prince outside. 
and then I'm about to come back and clean up my little mess. I did move my mirror from over there because I think I want my Christmas tree over there. And plus, I have more space over here for a mirror. So I think I'm going to keep my mirror over here. I need to move this picture frame to get that out of here. But here's the thing, though. I do have a bookshelf coming. And I was going to put my bookshelf over here. So if I do that, then my mirror can't be right here. So I don't know. We're going to worry about that later on in the in one of these vlogs but yeah super cute i'm excited i don't know when i go to work i just want to wear this all day and be cute yeah probably tomorrow because i'm not gonna put the camera back up i was gonna probably try to take y'all to work with me since this is gonna be like a week in a life or a few days in a life as a content creator with a six to six i'll probably take y'all with me and show y'all a little bit of stuff because it's been long overdue i recorded a vlog like that but i never edited it so I'll probably edit that and post that later, but I'll probably take out of work with me today. It's gonna be hopefully a chill night. It was only 5.51. We don't have a clock in until 6.30, but I'm about to go ahead and head to work. Um, since I am gonna try to record some footage, I don't want it to be too crowded when I'm going in. And I sprayed some of that sample perfume from some of them things, and the one that I sprayed stinks, and I think I got that stinking smell on me. So I'm trying to get it off me. Alright, my badge and stuff is already in here. About to turn on some music. I'm, I had McDonald's earlier today, but I didn't really eat it because my burger went hot. I ate the fries though, but yeah. I'll probably get something at work. So, our floor is being remade like remodeled so we're on a i'm on a different floor this floor is a lot nicer we kind of split up so i'll be able to record a lot more because we won't be too busy i'm about to text my cousin donna back real quick and then i'll talk to y'all when i get to the uh hospital because my battery's about to die so i'm going to record some stuff off my phone and then we'll switch back to the camera when i actually get there and get settled what a guy, your love is worth so much I can take. It's but I can't live without you. Jump first enemy. I'm not okay when we're apart, but I pretend. This is me walking into work. I did get there a little bit early so that I will be able to record and everything for you guys. Um, the walk is about like three or four minutes depending on and then gotta catch the elevator when it's really, really busy. Then it takes a long time for the elevator to come, girl. So yeah, this is 6.09, so I'm here really early. We ain't gotta clock in at 6.30. And we can clock in early at 6.23. So this is the farm on tonight. And then I'm just gonna clock in. Obviously, got to block everything. <laughs> I 
If you work in healthcare and you're not cleaning your station with them purple sunny wipes, girl. <laughs> Before I do anything, I clean under the keyboard, the mouse, the keyboard, under the table, my chair, everything. Everything. Super important. To charge my battery up too. It ain't enough plug-ins in here to go around. I promise. <laughs> like. That is just the dumbest thing ever. Light work on here. Cool, cool, cool. This week is a behind the scenes of a yeah. content creator with a six to six. I didn't so I'm doing like little stuff. Okay, okay. You know, I want to start. Yeah, just the blood rolls. Just doing everything right there. That vlog lifestyle so much because I talk too much. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. You run that mouth. Okay. But it's just like. I'm, I'm in the supply closet right now. I like to stock up my little machine. I'm on a different floor, like I told y'all, so this isn't like our original floor. So, normally we don't have to roll around this little bottles machine. My other floor, we have bottle machines in there already like stuck on the wall. So, yeah, I like to, I'm about to buy, actually. I switch up between small and medium gloves. I'm gonna do small today, because I know we're gonna have to do lab draws, so. I like to put this in right here. And then, what else I need? I'm gonna do um, a blood pressure cuff since everybody needs to have their own. I get two different sizes, small and a medium. Then I get, where's the temperature probes at? Here, we're gonna get two packs of these because we need these, and yeah, that's pretty much all I get right now since we're on this floor. Usually, I would make a whole cart, I'll probably put a picture. I used to um put water on the cart, all of this supply on the cart. Tonight, I got a lot of selves we call it a self um, people who could do for themselves. I only have like two total cares that literally need me to assist them with everything. Um, so yeah. That's what I'm about to do. I'm about to make about four. Put that right there. I don't know why I'm so loud. It's 8.13. I'm done with vitals. I got done vitals in like 20 minutes. So the people I got tonight is cool, chill. Not too much going down. Take my bed. The people I got tonight is cool, chill. Not too much going down. I got to get a hat for... She's actually a nurse. But anyways, that don't matter. I got to get a hat for a patient. She needs a stool sample and a urine sample. So this is going to go in the back. And then another one's in the front for stool and urine sample. Another one of my patients said that he wanted to take a like bath wash up, but I got a report today that he already had a bath. I checked the chart and he literally it says completely in a change, period care, all of that. So, like they all did it. They were independent after setup. So I'm like, what am I about to get another bath for if you already did one? So I'm about to go in there and be like, um, you're tech. <laughs> you know, like why why do you want another one? So I'm about to go ahead and get some stuff though, just in case he don't got none in there. Cause I'm not coming back up in here. So I get this and then I do deodorant, mouthwash, cleanser, um, lotion, two brush, two case. Um, since he's a man, sometimes I'll do shaving cream and a razor, but he didn't really request that, so I'm not gonna take that. Um, and then there's towels in the linen room. 
And I think that's all I need. I'm going to get him a new pair of socks and a gown and stuff. But literally, she told me he got one. And they tried it that he got one. So, I don't know. We're probably going to see. Because, mm -mm. And also, it's 8.15. Our cafeteria closes at 9 and then open back up at 10. I'm hungry. So, I'm about to hear up and try to go downstairs and get something to eat first. And then let him, like, set all this up and let him wash himself. Yeah. So right now it's about 3.15, 3.13 in the morning. I am watching Jane the Virgin. Um, I started this a while back and I'm trying to finish it. Um, this is the last round of vitals. We do vitals every four hours. So 7, 11, and 3 a.m. It's 3 a.m. So I just got done with doing my vitals. And now I'm about to um, watch a few little, um, what is this? Like learning modules or whatever <clears throat> that they be wanting us to watch and complete oh, excuse me and then i would kind of read a little bit yes yeah, 3 13 so i was trying to read as well and then maybe that other clip was like at 11 o'clock vitals i don't know anyways we gotta draw blood now as a tech so i get one bag and i fill that one bag up with everything that i would need and then i will subcategorize it by my patients so obviously you can't see what patient i'm doing this for i just make the bags all the same standard out with the gauze the band-aid alcohol wipe the tourniquet um the needle i think that's a what is that 23 gauge needle and then depending on the patient if they need a purple tube purple top green top gold top red top whichever and then i pack all of that in there and then i'll put their name tag in that front cover part obviously i turned it down face so you can't see because uh yeah hipaa <laughs> ain't trying to lose my job okay and then after i'm done with labs i will go ahead and chart this last round of vital signs so yeah the other charting was for 11 o'clock vitals this one is for my 3 a.m vital signs and then kind of at the end of the shift we like to um like if my patient has a foley i empty out the foley's empty out the urinals empty out the bedside commodes um just kind of whatever the patient needs just getting ready for the day shift and then we will take out the trash throw it in the trash shoot trash shoot the linen throw it in the linen shoot all of that i have like a dedicated video of like taking you guys to work with me to kind of show a little bit more in depth of doing this because if i was to show every little bit then this vlog would be like three hours long because it's already an hour and 30 minutes so yeah that's kind of how i end my night then i watch my show and you know like i said i'm on a kind of chill floor so yeah hey y'all today is 604 i was vlogging a little bit last night at work on my camera and on my phone as well so it's 605 i got off this morning i left a little bit early this morning because i was tired i had initially only had five hours of sleep the previous day so i just went and picked up two more packages that i have to this i bought the shein one is actually sponsored stuff so i want to open up the shein one to see what i got last night was a good night at work I, like i said i was on a different floor so <laughs> wasn't nothing too bad i had a lot of sales i think i told y'all that so i literally only got called to do something maybe like four times in like 12 hours all right what is this this is a hair straightener brush from shein oh my gosh i'm so excited this must be the so i got three different collabs to do for like black friday with them they sent me a beauty a beauty box i picked out household items i believe and then i picked out clothes so i got the clothes i showed y'all that yesterday this must be the beauty box because this look like this say a neck mask so yeah this is this is in the beauty box is random i didn't pick anything they just send random beauty products to show so this is some nose strips some blemish patches i'll probably do like a reel in the tiktok of this so I can just show y'all what I got right now. And what is this, girl? This is maybe like some type of like makeup bag, Bear Care. Oh, I remember this when I was a kid. Care Bear? I said Bear Care, Lord Jesus. Little makeup bag, that's cute. I thought they was gonna have a lot of items. I thought they said 20 items, so I'm not sure. They sent some press on nails, and then this is some type of hand mask. And yeah, that's it. 
That's one. And I hate, I like pretty little thing got, you know, their own packaging, but I like discreet packaging because baby, you never know who might be trying to steal your package. That's also why I don't have branded packaging right now for my actual hair brand because I don't need nobody stealing y'all hair. You know, people be crazy and shady. Okay, so I got the little cute two-piece matching bodysuit with the sweatpants. I got it in black and then I also got it in brown. The brown, I got the two tops in a medium. Just wanted to make sure I'd be able to fit them. And then I got these brown ones in an extra small. And then I got the black ones in a size small because they kind of seem like they ran a little big. So I'm gonna try on the black first to see how I like them because I cannot wait. So these are the brown ones. The brown ones I did get in a size extra small. And girl, I'm definitely glad I didn't get no medium because these would have been so baggy on me. Reference, I'm 145 pounds, 5'3". I wish I would have got the black in an extra small now because, yeah, they definitely got a lot of stretch to them still. Like, it's an extra small on me. So, I like these. Can't wait to try the whole outfit on. The size small is definitely a ton more stretch. It's not baggy. It's just more really feeling like that sweatpants material. So, they still fit fine. Would I have liked the extra small? Yes, but honestly, the small is cool. This one just ain't doing enough coming back down <laughs> like the gray ones, but I like them. Can't wait to try the full fit on. Then pretty little thing decal right there. So for the rest of today, like I said, it's 614. I probably won't vlog for the rest of today. Bay is here. We're gonna actually go to one of his friends' house to watch the game. And I'm gonna be editing for the rest of tonight, so that'll be boring to just record me editing. Um, I'm gonna edit a vlog, and maybe if I can get done with that vlog, I'll start editing um, a little bit more TikToks and stuff. But that's pretty much all I'm gonna do for like work related today. I know this is like a week in life or days in life as a consecrated with the 66. I don't actually gotta go to my hospital job anymore for the rest of this week. I'm off until next Monday, so that's good. I just have a lot, well, a ton of content to get through, so. I'll probably talk to y'all tomorrow. We're actually going to be going um, to some stores and stuff tomorrow. So I don't know if I'm going to plug that into this vlog or a different one. So I'll just talk to y'all tomorrow. Hey y'all, today's the next day. It is the, I want to say the 16th. I'm not sure. I don't have my phone and my battery's about to die. None of my camera batteries are charged. It is the, yeah, Thursday, November 16th. I just did my hair. Me and Bay about to go. To some stores like i said yesterday i'm just wearing this green shirt with my pants that i got from target that i had showed y'all in my target haul i um, wish they was just an inch longer but it's fine so i'm just wearing this green shirt with these cute little jeans from tarjay i'm probably gonna tuck one in i'm about to look on pinterest to see how girlies like to wear they stuff because i don't want to wrinkle it because i just use my steamer for the first time not on my pants just on my shirt so i'm about to look up some stuff on pinterest let my batteries kind of charge a little bit before we head out and go eat downtown and i will talk to y'all then pray you get that job in tampa that's only four hours away. Take a car, take a plane, baby, whichever is fastest. Uh, whichever one. Thank you. Free can of friends, too. Yeah, you into everything I'm into. Oh, I got something that I could lend you. Huh, a peace of mind, baby. Come and get a peace of mind. Yeah. Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait. Fuck your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's the feeling that I get when we lock lips. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I fuck your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring your easel and pencil suit. Here you go, you try to tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said, I'm trying to keep it tight for my niggas. This is where I got my bed from. This is my bed without those, but. Oops. 
1,500 still. So, hey y'all, we're back home. We went to the mall, went and looked at a few things, and we went to the suit store in the mall, went to the furniture store in the mall. We went to um, H&M to look in there a little bit. We went to Pandora. Um, I know y'all been seeing the viral tennis bracelet going viral on um, TikTok. So literally they had a whole wait list and the list was dang near full. So I put Bay name on there. She said that she had some in stock around December 3rd or 4th. Um, so she says first come first serve so basically what she gonna do is call the people at the top and then go down but since she told me they ain't gonna be in stock until like the third or fourth obviously i can just look online and then do like pick up in store so i may try to do that finesse it or tell him because i want it for christmas but if they're gonna be sold out girl then i might just have to go up on there and snag it myself so yeah anyways since this video is pertaining to me working a 6 to 6 p.m and being a content creator at the same time i'm going to show y'all also what my job is is a entrepreneur <laughs> i have my own hair business if you guys don't know that by now i do sell raw vietnamese hair so this hair that i just got delivered this isn't for black friday um this is going to be for me and my cousin my cousin ordered three bundles i think she got 18 20 and 22 and i am getting a sew in on monday so i can promote my brand um, i'm going to be promoting the brand that whole week i'm going to be posting like videos to like instagram reels and tiktok for that whole entire week but i'm just gonna all the hair comes co-washed so i am going to co-wash this hair <laughs> this one is mine a 28 inch and then these three are my cousin dinah so this is how it looks straight out the pack real cute real bouncy mm -hmm. and then these are double weft real thick and full top to bottom so i'm going to go ahead and co-wash these <laughs> and then after i'm done co-washing i'm going to show y'all how i hang them and stuff like that i know he started doing it because of oreo babe Huh. How we used to tell Oreo down yeah. and we would like reward him for that when we were trying to teach him that. Yeah, so now like Prince just continuously does it and it drives me insane. Because I'm like, I said sit, not down. <laughs> so enjoy me conditioning the hair. When you buy hair from my brand, your hair will already come co-washed. So therefore you don't have to do anything to it but get it installed in your head. So yeah, you don't have to wash your hair when you get it. But I also wanted to touch base on a comment that I just got today, earlier today when I had posted my original Black Friday sale. Um, it was like 15% off and somebody was like, girl, that is not a sale. And then someone else had commented and she was like, exactly. Um, something about being greedy or something like that. Honey, one thing I'm not is greedy. This is my very first business. We are all learning as we go. I always ask polls and stuff on Instagram. Like I have no problem with giving discounts, like clearly. So I literally was asking, you know, just different things or whatever. So I can take constructive criticism, but like saying that, that just wasn't cute, that wasn't cool. So they are now, y'all know how I do. <laughs> it only take one time. They are now not being from my channel, but like they will never be able to comment ever again on another video. The user is like they're here for my channel but i just want to say i hope they're watching this and i hope you see this you could have literally just said you know like hey like you know could we get this 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 much off like you know you can suggest things like i literally have no problem with giving my girlies a good sale but also i sell raw hair 
I don't sell virgin hair. Raw hair is extremely high. And for me to still even be able to make somewhat of a profit, you know, like there's only so much I can discount. But I just want to touch base on that. Literally, if there's something that you would like to maybe suggest or like, you know, um, this is for y'all, like obviously I'm doing this for y'all, you can, you know, answer my polls and, you know, give me some feedback. Hey y'all. Today is Friday, November 17th, 10.47 in the morning. This got my hair. I just took my bonnet off about an hour and a half ago. Bay left at like nine something. Um, oh, oh, people watching outside. I got up, washed my face, brushed my teeth, all of that. Took Prince outside. He was just taking a nap as y'all saw here, A and everything. Um, I got up real quick. Well, I've been up since he left, but I got up because I saw that FedEx had delivered um, this collaboration that I have to do. It's a bookcase. Um, they delivered that about 10 minutes ago, so I'm about to just bring that inside. And then today, I also want to do this wig review for Love Me. I also want to do the lovely wholesale haul. And then I need to plug in the perfume sponsorship in front of this one video that I plan to um, post for Sunday. So, yeah, I'm just a little tired. It's 10 for day, so I'm probably about to cook me some breakfast, like some bacon. Ooh. Excuse me, bacon and sausages, and then lay down a little bit. I should probably be doing this wig review right now, but I'm tired. <laughs> so, I'm about to get this and see. Heavy girl. This is why I look girl. I definitely did not do my hair. But the um bookcase is actually it's white and then the like um the actual like frame of it or whatever, the the metal pieces are gold. And y'all know I don't do gold. My apartment is black, white, silver. <laughs> my accent is silver. I used to do gold way back when. I'm over it now. And plus I just feel like if you're like if you have stainless steel appliances and stuff like that i just feel like the silver just it just all correlates and just look really nice together rather than throwing gold in so anyways i'm gonna spray paint it after i do the i may ask them if i can just go ahead and like spray paint it and put it up but you know they probably would want me to show the actual product before spray painting it. So I'll probably just do the review and show it as gold. But if y'all see it in the video that it's gonna be in, then just know it's gonna be spray painted black. I'm not gonna keep it gold. So yeah, but the thing is, I would rather spray paint it before putting it together. So I'm gonna have to take it apart and probably spray paint it that way. Unless if I can just cover it up really well. Anyways. It's gonna be spray painting, it's gonna be black instead of gold. But I'm thinking about putting, depending on how big that is, I was thinking about putting the bookcase over here on this wall, but this is also, I was gonna put my tree over here where that plant is now because I moved my mirror. But now that I, when I go outside and like walk around and like drive and stuff like that, you can definitely see my apartment and you'll be able to see the tree inside of here. So I'll probably still, I'm definitely putting a bookcase right here because there's not really anywhere else to put it. Because I feel like if I put it there, it's just gonna be too much going on over there. And then since I already got this right here, 
print stuff right here. I was thinking of maybe putting it right here, but it's like the bookcase is something that I would want to show off. And then Bay was like, was I putting it in here? And I'm like, I'm going to kind of revamp this room again as well. But I think I'm going to actually set up my vanity and stuff over there. And I am going to get a TV up here mounted. And then I'm going to get a, um, a slightly type of entertainment center type of dresser to go right here. So it's like... It's not really a spot <laughs> to put it in here either. And plus, I want it to be showcased. So right here is really just the best spot for the bookcase. Then I was like, well, I can kind of scoot this table over a little bit more this way. And then I can still put the tree, like picture the mirror not being right here. So the bookcase is going to be against this wall. It'll probably come out to about this far. And then I can still put the tree right here. So we'll see. I'm going to take out the base of the tree and i'm just going to put because the tree comes in three different like tiers so i'm going to put the first tier on the bottom down here and see how it spreads out and stuff like that because i can scoop this over just a little bit more <laughs> and then that's it so if i put it right here i know you'll be able to see see it out the window so i just i just want people to be able to kind of see my tree out one of these windows so yeah i'm probably my stomach is hurting right now. It's 10 57. I don't have anything to just cook really quickly, like popping in a pizza or something, because that's kind of my mood right now. Um, oh, I'm crazy. I did my grocery haul for y'all. I can cook me some chicken nuggets, the Chick fil A dupes. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to get up and pop some of those in the air fryer in the next probably hour because my stomach is kind of upset and I don't want to eat and get it more upset so after I pop that in there eat I'm going to start on my wig review this shouldn't take too long because the wig I believe is a five by five closure so with closures usually I can just do them glueless and then what I do with my real hair I don't braid or anything I'm going to get in the shower the reason why I'm not jumping to do this right now is because I will have to get in the shower then slick back my hair like get my hair wet slick it back into a slick back not really ponytail it'll be a ponytail but then i usually braid my ponytail and then pin it up then put the wig cap on all of that then <laughs> i would have to sometimes i do my makeup before sometimes i do the wig first um but normally i'll go ahead and do my makeup and then do the wig since it is just a five by five closure i don't have to really just glue anything down and yeah, it's, it's gonna take a process. And the whole wig, wig reviews are really easy, especially when they just want a dedicated video. Um, they pay for a dedicated video this time instead of, instead of me recording it into a vlog. Um, so yeah, usually all I do is just showcase the hair and then talk about it, show me installing it. And really all you need is an eight minute video on YouTube if they haven't changed it to get it monetized. Um, that's able to be paid for the video any video shorter than that. I don't think you can get paid for don't quote me on that because they did just change the watch time and subscriber uh, You know Count or whatever or what you need, but yeah hair reviews are really easy It's just I know after the hair review I'm gonna have to jump straight into doing a clothing review and then it's, it's, it's just a lot so I just need to be in the right headspace and I definitely need to eat before doing all of that so like I said, it's only 1047. The hair review itself should only take me, like just reviewing the hair, should only take me like 20 minutes. It's the prep time of, you know, getting all the shots, angles, and you know, all of that crap. So that's just what goes into this. This is this is what I do. Hey y'all, update. It's 1.54 in the evening now. I got up. Ate. I actually ate some leftovers from last night. So I um, got up eight. I did my hair, put it in a slick back um, ponytail braid or whatever for this wig review. So right now, I just did my eyebrows. And I did a very, very light coat of foundation. Like, I'm almost, well, I'm out of my favorite Fenty foundation. This is my foundation that I wear in the wintertime because we all get lighter. Well, I'm pretty sure everybody usually get lighter in the winter. Doesn't not really be outside and not much sun. So this is my shade for the winter time, 385. And then for the summertime, I do like the MAC NC50, but this is basically like a dupe for it and more affordable. I think I talked about trying this last time. I like it, but 
I probably won't buy this again unless like I absolutely have to. I'm going to keep my shade on here. Anyways, this is more so like my summertime color, but I just like the MAC overall better because honestly, you're paying $40 or $50 for quality. So this would do for a quick little, you know, you dig, but I do like the MAC NC50 and I think it has SPF in it as well. Anyways, I'm going to use Too Faced Born This Way concealer and not even doing a lot like literally just a little bit because only thing i gotta do is that wig review and i mean the start of the show is the wig and if you just pop on lashes and some lip gloss along with your eyebrows and stuff done you look good so i'm not trying to do too much today because i don't really feel like taking off tons and tons of makeup so we're gonna do a little bitty simple light very 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 light beat of some makeup <sighs> I'm gonna put a little bit just down here. I'm not doing any on my forehead because I don't care. All right, we're gonna let this do what it does. I'm gonna put just a little bit of something on my eyelids. Like y'all know, I don't even do eyeshadow, so you already know I'm not about to do much. I'm about to use this Jaclyn Hill palette that I got for Christmas like three years ago, probably. Yeah, three years ago. It's funny because it says only use this for 12 months for the expiration day. But you know, I'm a rebel or whatever. We use stuff a little bit longer than that anyway. <laughs> and who actually knew about the makeup expiration days? Like I found that out, I think going into my freshman year of college that makeup had an expiration date. So that was like what, 2016, fall 2016. Somewhere around that time, I found out that makeup had an uh, expiration date. But whatever. Yeah, like I said, eyeshadow is not something I do. It's not my strong suit. I can literally just do enough to get by. So I usually just do some type of brown color to kind of just make them pop just a little bit so you can see that I got something there but still subtle enough to kind of just blend in with my normal like skin tone if that makes sense so that's all i'm gonna do contour i'm only gonna do a little bit i like to use this palette or the anastasia's palette and this real techniques real techniques brush minimum mid and max how far you can have it out so i go scroll it down to the max and then I will carve out like that. And I just shaped my face and everything too. So I feel like my application is looking very, very flawless. And then we're gonna just buff that upward. Mm, it's a lot. And I wanna try powdered contour because sometimes the cream can kinda just sorta look like mud. That makes sense. But you know, you just gotta Buff that out. Always go upward. All right, and I'm watching. Um, I am Chelsea Janae, so I'm about to just continue this and then put music over this. hard to make, so I bet they on their face right now. When he tell the story, that's not how I went. Know they be lying a hundred percent. Moved out of the wrist and forgot about that bitch. Why they just call me to tell me come get it? Now that boy off and I don't want no credit. If it was me, they wouldn't regret it. Let me be dead and now they won't get it. Party still pity, my niggas still eat it. Like you're the little lady. All right, so I just got done with the Love Me Hair Review. Um... My makeup's done, hair is done, obviously. So I'm about to go ahead and start on this lovely wholesale haul. Um, I actually really do enjoy this wig. This is cute. I may keep this. I usually sell all my wigs, mostly that I um, review. I did have this one wig from Love Me that I absolutely adored and loved. I think I got it in like 2021 and I've been rocking out with it since. But it's kind of time to 
throw that wig away and retire it. So I think this is probably going to be my next, like, if I need to hurry up and throw on a type of, like, throw on a wig to do something, this is going to be it. Um, loving the color. It is a 5x5 five five glue. You just go watch the video to understand about it. But I did have a wig like this in all black that I really, really adore, really, really loved. It was HD lace, all of that. Um, so yeah. I like this one. I think I'm going to actually keep this and not sell it and keep this as my throw on and go wig. So enough with that. I'm about to unplug all of my hot tools so I don't burn the house down. Um, didn't really make a mess because like I said, the wig didn't really take much of anything. So I'm about to clean up this so I don't have a too big of a mess. I don't know where I want to do the lovely wholesale haul. Like sometimes I'll put up this wallpaper specifically to do clothing hauls and stuff with like to do all of my youtube stuff in this specific room but i really just need to organize it a little bit better like because i got my hair and stuff over here like i don't know i don't know i think i may just go ahead and do it in the where i usually do my hauls at just to do it really really quickly and to get it out the way i only have like five things to try on so we're about to go ahead and do that um i'm gonna let them hot tools cool down for a little bit and honestly i'm just gonna come back and clean that because while i got my mojo i need to hurry up and try to record so my little recording nook is right here i like to do my clothing hauls and stuff right here so i need to scoot some of this christmas stuff out the way doing like this is a really good spot to put the mirror to get like full body pics and stuff but i think i may i'm gonna have a bookshelf over here so i ain't gonna be able to do this no more but this is cute i like i like this if i take a picture this this, this a vibe like this a vibe i don't know what else to say Am I feeling myself? Yes. So this is how the background is going to be. Um, I like to kind of just have a little bit of, you know, something going on in the background. Mine is that Merry Christmas. I'll probably switch my angle like this. So yeah, this is cute. So I like to just sit, have something in the background and just be cute. So I'm about to get into this clothing haul. Um, go watch the video. I don't know if this is going to be posted before that. We'll see if they approve this i don't know but go watch the clothing haul to see how i styled these pieces so i usually do a test shot so i want to record see the height and the length that i want things i'm gonna do a little pose we'll turn around if i know and i'll stop the video then i will play it I think I want it a little bit higher. Let me find Prince. Go. You about to get stepped off. So I'm blogging off my phone right now. No reason y'all not getting y'all content in <laughs> because baby, yes ma'am. So I'm blogging off my phone right now. Um, I don't want to move this because I got it in a really really good spot that I know like yeah it's hitting all the angles. It's good, but. What I wanted to say was, I'm doing a lot in this vlog, in this video. I normally do not do this. <laughs> my wigs do not ever look, I need to fix my lip gloss cause it's like gone and like starting to peel. Let me try to pop y'all up. But I normally never have, oh, this is not working. There we go. I normally never have like busy, busy weeks like this or days for that matter. Um, it's just because, you know, Black Friday next week and all these brands are, you know, needing promo, wanting promo um, and stuff like that. So also I'm trying to get inventory for my brand <laughs> because, whoop, called it. All right, like I was saying, I normally don't be doing all this stuff, <laughs> but it is busy because of Black Friday and I am trying to hear up and get this 
uh, sponsor content to these brands for that reason too. But also, I need money for my inventory for my brand. So I am doing all of this fairly quickly. So I know, love me, I've had the same rep. Her name is Iris for a minute now. Um, I believe since like 2021 maybe. That's when I like remember like really, really emailing her and her giving me a lot of wigs and stuff. But anyways, they normally pay me really quickly. Like, love me, my girl Iris, I'm gonna get paid either like same day or like next day. If they don't got like no Chinese holidays, different stuff like that going on, I normally get paid fairly quickly, knock on wood, me saying that. Hopefully <laughs> I still get paid pretty early. But yeah, so I'm doing them first and lovely wholesale. I worked with them a long time ago. I can't remember how fast I get paid, but since I'm already done up, it's easy to just go ahead and knock clothing reviews out the way as well, because if I don't, then that means like tomorrow or the next day, I'm just gonna have to do glam all over again. So if you do have like a wig review or something like that to do, or like a makeup product, since you already dialed up, if you got something to like showcase or show off, go ahead and knock that content out the way as well. So I try to get everything done in one day and then i'll just edit you know the next day or whatever like that so since i am trying to hear up and get these videos to them though hair reviews are easy to edit as long as they're a dedicated hair review video like a video by itself and this lovely wholesale like i said the the video was like 10 minutes long so at most it's probably gonna be like eight minutes so that's gonna be easy the other thing it's gonna take a minute is like vlogs when i gotta put in a sponsorship in a vlog so yeah, tonight I am going to edit this hair review in Lovely Wholesale so I can go ahead and get them sent off because they're going to need my money. Um, so yeah, and then YouTubers, we get paid on the 21st every month. So that's next Tuesday, I believe. Um, so yeah, super exciting. But I just wanted to say that like I normally don't have this busy of a schedule. It's just, girl, I'm trying to get this money for my brand as well as helping these other brands out. So that's just how it goes. So I'm about to um let my phone charge and then I'm just about to model the rest of these clothes. And honestly, that's it. And then we gonna cook my food. And depending on how long this vlog already is, this might be the end of it tonight. I'll probably show y'all me editing or whatever, but honestly, that may be it. So I just got done with the um, thingy. It only, I only been recording for 10 minutes. You have to have your video, I think at least eight minutes to get monetized. So hopefully I can, I can make it like eight minutes. With my intro and the outro, that'll be about an extra 30 seconds because <laughs> when I actually go to edit it and I gotta like cut stuff out, it tremendously chops down the video. So if I like stutter over my words, if I want to say something over again, so it's like I really need it to be eight minutes exact. So I'm about to try these on real quick with the camera vertical. So I'm, I'll probably try to record on my phone and show y'all. And then, yeah, after that, um, the only other collab, so I did the hair review and then I'm doing the lovely wholesale one. And then the only other thing that I have to do is that perfume. I need to plug in like a sponsor portion in the video. Let me go ahead and start this because baby, it is 4.55. I could have been done if I actually did this this morning, but I don't know. I mean, that's why I work night shift. Like I'm the type of person who is a night, is it raining? I'm a night owl. So I will be up until like three o'clock in the morning recording YouTube videos. I've done it before and it is just what I do. That is why I work night shift overnight because sometimes I be struggling to stay up overnight working. But ultimately, I feel like I am more at peace with doing content and just working, working in general, whether that be my actual job with clocking in or content. I just feel more at peace with doing it at night. Like, I don't know, it's just something about the calmness of everything. And I don't know, I just, I just like doing it at night. This prince, he needs some more water, so he hitting the thing. Whew. All right, my my living room is just a wreck, and I need to figure out when I'm about to do this. Oh, that's what I want to talk to y'all about too. I'm sorry, I'm doing a lot of talking to this, but baby, th th this is just the reality. 
So I'm planning to do a YouTube ebook. I kind of already started it like four months ago, but I never finished it. And I had posted that I was getting paid $500 for a 60 second little video on Instagram. Really, it turned out to be 30 seconds, but still. And I was like, I need to stop playing and I need to basically give y'all this ebook. I haven't did it though because I want to make sure that I'm giving all the information that I want to give. Like how I'm talking to y'all right now, maybe 10 minutes later, I'm going to think of something else that I wanted to say. And that's how I feel with ebook. Like obviously nothing's perfect, but it's like, I asked that y'all wanted on Black Friday. This was like two and a half weeks ago. A hundred people voted, yeah. And two people voted. It was like, yeah, girl, put me on. And then the other thing to vote no, it was like, nah, I figured out myself. Two people said, nah, I figured out myself. Okay, baby, do you? But I better not see you in my, <laughs> in my Shopify store buying it. <laughs> but yeah, um, so yeah, Black Friday is next Friday, so a week from now. Um, also, people do stuff for Cyber Cyber Monday. Um, I was gonna have like a hair sale for Cyber Monday and like Black Friday, or whatever. So I'm like, as long as I can get the ebook done by next, not next Monday, but Monday after Black Friday, I feel like I'll be okay. I already have like the chapters and stuff like that that I wanna talk about. It's just me actually sitting down and figuring out and actually getting down everything that I wanna say. That's my problem. So I probably definitely can't do it tomorrow. Definitely can't do it Sunday. Monday I'm getting my hair done and then I'm gonna be worried about hair content. Um, Tuesday, I'm gonna be worried about hair content. Um, Wednesday, I do have to go to work. So, I'll probably just be editing. I don't know, it's, it's just like, I don't really have time to just sit down and do it right now since I am trying to promote for my hair business. Um, I can definitely do it at work. Like, I can start writing stuff at work if I have downtime. So, I may try to do that depending on what floor I'm on. Um, so yeah. But I know for sure, because Thursday I'm going to be with Bay and his family for Thanksgiving. And then Friday, it's going to be Black Friday. So it's like I'm going to be worried about my business and stuff as long as in Saturday. I don't know. It's just every day I feel like I'm going to try to take at least like an hour. An hour out my day while I'm at home to like sit down and like write about stuff for the ebook. So I feel like an hour a day up until like next because saturday i mean saturday i could definitely do it up until like next saturday to like actually have like a full day of doing because why well, i just get a notification that i had a package <laughs> for me to come get it i don't know why they don't <sighs> whatever i don't know why they don't put it in the little amazon hub thingy or whatever all right let's get into this this package is from shein and baby why is it open because who been be peeking in my package <laughs> All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and open it right here where it's already open it. And I'm gonna take this jacket off too because it was cold outside, baby. It's not cold in here. I got my heat on. Comment down below if y'all got y'all heat on already. We didn't have some cold nights from it being really rainy and you know, whatever. Okay, anyway. Girl, I forgot what I ordered. I think this is the box of like, I got a clothing box, I got a beauty box, and then this is the like household item box. So I'm really excited about this. I'm gonna do like a whole haul about all of this stuff um, in December. One of my, supposedly, one of my Vlogmas vlogs is going to be um, like a Shein home items haul, whatever. Anyways, what is this? I think this is my, um paper for the air fryer i need to look back at what all i uh told them i wanted i think this is what you put in for the air fryer so you don't mess up your air fryer but it's like parchment paper like it's, i don't know whatever that is it was just a lot of stuff okay i got my exfoliating glove what is this for food contact girl i need to i gotta look back on my stuff because i don't know what I didn't uh select it to get. <laughs> I have no idea what this is. Like I don't know. I don't know, girl. I don't know what that is, girl. <laughs> okay, a little bag I got for when I travel. This is this says wash wash bag so when i travel that's where my dirty clothes gonna go in definitely needed that for when i went to vegas i got 
these little clips that you put on your jeans to um little jean clips y'all know what i'm talking about this ain't even a full haul for this i'm just excited to see what i got because i do not remember what i picked that i picked this stuff out like three weeks ago and what is this girl in videos like this i usually only need to do like a tiktok anyway so i gotta show like me using the product so it's fine that I, oh, okay a little travel bag cool i was thinking about traveling when i did this honey this was like fresh right when i got back okay a little cute food container can never have too many of those when i'm eating i like stuff like that to divide out my fruit all right i can't wait so i'm about to go ahead and probably open most of this stuff now because girl it's like oh i just love collaborations and stuff because it just be feeling like christmas all year round but like really when it's like almost christmas and you getting all these packages in to like review and all these collabs like it is just so fun and it just feel like christmas okay this is cute definitely taking this to work and definitely taking this on the plane because baby i'll be hot so it come with a little yeah yeah whatever we'll, we'll talk about all that later oh this is too cute and then it got a little hook that you can hook it on stuff oh this is too cute and it got different settings girl okay she is <laughs> oh this feels amazing y'all come on y'all yeah okay oh i'm too turned up right now that i'm super turned about this one is a vacuum cleaner from she in y'all like girl Y'all better stay tuned for this video that I post with all these links and stuff because baby girl. All right, so I'm finally done <laughs> with the haul. It is 6.31, so I don't feel like that's bad timing. Um, I started the wig review at what, like two o'clock maybe? Let me see on my phone. Let's see when I took a picture. Um okay i was in the process yeah so i was in the process right here of doing my hair like the lace was still on <laughs> and this was at 2 40 p.m so yeah i started the hair review about two something and then got done at about so it took about an hour at three so let's just say two three four five six so only like four hours for a wig review and a clothing haul while recording a behind the scenes video i think that's pretty good and also i took some breaks like i literally had to go get a package i took prints outside twice and yeah i've, I've been breaking but now i'm done uh feel really good hopefully the clips are really good because i didn't put my glasses on to recheck all the clips um so yeah i feel good about it um my oven is done preheating right now y'all see a lot of pots and pans on the oven let's not worry about it <laughs> um i cooked last night for me and bae i cooked he didn't clean up that's how it go if you cook the other person clean up he didn't clean up so <laughs> i'm gonna believe it on him but i'm about to go ahead and put my i'm about to go ahead and put my pork chops in the oven because they're they're pretty thick so they might take about two hours to cook i normally cook stuff in about an hour and 30 minutes like any type of meat i cook depending on what it is obviously like not a roast but like any other simple type of meat I just cook it for about an hour and 30 minutes in on like a high temp and maybe it'd be perfect. Okay, and we're not gonna worry about, you know what? Let me, let me just show y'all the aftermath of stuff like this. This is what happens. So this is a collab, don't mind that. This is my Christmas stuff that I'm gonna put out. So don't mind that, but like all of this, this is all my new stuff. I ain't even did nothing with this. I just unboxed that. That's the clothes from Lovely Wholesale. These some jeans I had wore the other day. This is collaboration stuff right here. This is clothes that I brung out that I was gonna match up with some of the Lovely Wholesale stuff. That's like some pretty little thing stuff that I had bought and showed y'all. Like a mess, an absolute mess. And then my beauty room ain't too bad cause yeah. I still ain't unpacked from Vegas completely. Let's not talk about it. <laughs> I just gotta clean off my desk and honestly, that's good. So that'd be the aftermath of stuff like this. It just be taking a lot. So 
I'm about to put my food on and then after I put my food on, I'm going to upload all of my um, footage to my hard drive. And that usually takes about, the clips ain't that long, so it shouldn't take that long, but I'm gonna upload all of my hair clips for this wig review and all of my lovely wholesale clips. So that'll take a minute. And I can't find my gray shirt that I took off, so I just put this one back on from earlier today. But yeah, and I need to get to cooking this too because this say this expired, uh, it say sale by the 15th and they packed it on the 12th. So I think they packed it the day that I picked it up because it's the 17th right now. So I'm about to go ahead and put two pork chops in the oven and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. These are thick. I'm gonna cook two, say one for tomorrow most likely. Ooh. And let that be that. So let me get my stuff, girl. Get myself together. potatoes but i'm really tired of mashed potatoes i had mashed potatoes for like three nights and i just cooked it last night um so y'all know how i cook my chicken what i call my famous meal i put the potatoes in with the chicken but i don't really want to use cream of chicken for my pork chops i have before it's just kind of like a smothered pork chop if you will i might just go ahead and do it because i really want my potatoes cooked in a cream of chicken. I normally used to cook a dish of like potatoes by itself with that cream of chicken on there, but I'm about to go ahead and cook the pork chops in there with it too. So this isn't the can I normally like to get. I like the kind that say heart healthy, but this was bought by a friend. So baby, beggars can't be true. Baby, I don't know why you wanna do me wrong. See when I'm home, I'm all alone. And you are always gone Boy, you know I really love you I can't deny I can't see how you could bring me To so many tears after all these years See, my days are cold without you Okay, so my food is on. Oh, my neck hurt. <sighs> While I'm <sighs> waiting on my food to get done, I'm gonna upload this stuff. It's 7 06 right now. I used to edit in Final Cut Pro. Final Cut Pro, I absolutely love, but what stole my heart was CapCut. So I started to edit on CapCut, and CapCut just already have a lot of like stuff on there like transitions effects and all of that already embedded in the system rather than final cut pro it's usually you have to like go find your own green screens this this and that and go find like your own like button like all of the extra stuff ain't already embedded in final cut pro now final cut pro definitely still is top tier definitely that girl but cap cut just already have everything on there and like they're continuously like updating stuff adding stuff so i just I just prefer cap cut now and that's how I edit my TikToks, all of that. So like when I like something, I can favorite it on my phone and then it'll still be favorited on my MacBook because I'm like logged into my cap cut account. Now Final Cut Pro obviously is not offered on <laughs> your freaking phone. So I like it in that sense because it correlates with one another. Whatever I do on the phone, it'll correlate to what's on here as far as like saving different effects and stuff like that what is this girl okay this must be a pack with me okay so what i like to do is go to imovie and look at all of my clips it's just a lot faster than cap cut um looking at clips so i like to go in here look at all my clips see what i need to upload so i need to start at this clip 
And then all of this is hair review. Oh, I look so good. This wig is so cute. And that's the review. And then this, like some of this stuff isn't lovely wholesale. Like this is me recording on two separate SD cards, the behind the scenes of, you know, a content creator with a 66. So yeah, I don't need none of that. So I need to stop right before. So when I'm modeling the hair at 46 seconds is where I need to stop. And then for the review, somewhere up in here to the content creator vlog so this okay definitely recommend all right so that's 10 minutes this is five real quick minutes. with the camera vertical so i i feel like i am more at peak okay so i need the 10 minute clip all of this is me talking about the haul and stuff or whatever else. Okay. And this is what I need. Okay. So we cool, we cool, we cool. So then I go to my hard drive. So we all in a little bit. Boom, boom, boom. All right. So then I click on my hard drive. Make it big for right now. Um... <clears throat> This is the blog that I just posted, so we can move that to the trash. New blog reset. Oh, okay, this is stuff that I'm still editing. So I need to keep that on there. We're gonna add a new folder. This folder is gonna be called um, Love Me Hair Review. Then we're gonna do another folder, and that's gonna be lovely wholesale i'm just gonna abbreviate it haul all right now we're gonna make this small again then i'm gonna bring up the sd card click on this go to everything and then we're gonna select my clips so i'm supposed to start with the hair review see i forgot where it stopped it don't tell me how long i think this is me modeling the hair yeah, and then this is me top. Okay. And then over here in the corner, that's how long it's gonna take to download. Oh, so that's saying three minutes, a minute, three minutes, four minutes. When the clips are larger, like when I be filming multiple long clips, like 10 minutes a piece, that turns into an hour. So that's what be taking so long with me trying to, you know, edit and stuff. It gotta upload to my hard drive and then from my hard drive, I gotta upload it to CapCut. So it just be too much. So it's kind of lagging because I gotta let it upload and generate into CapCut. As you can see, it say generating proxy. I upload my under proxy because my files be too big and this is saving up space. So it's on 33%. So I'm gonna let that do what it do. Um, I've been watching, I watch my, how do you say her name? McKenna, McKenna Walker. Chris, you gotta know her. She almost got half a million <laughs> subscribers, but her vlogs, she do weekly vlogs and they're always like about two hours long and she get like heck of views on here. But I mean like, people love to be in your business <laughs> that's just like me. So it's like, people gonna, it's like your own little reality show. So people be tuned in. But it's like, I had started watching her like a year or so ago. And then I kind of just stopped like no apparent reason. Like she's a wonderful blogger. Content always go crazy, baby. Um, so yeah, like a year ago, this self-care, motivation, whatever, I had watched that. And that's really what kind of brought me to her was the self-care videos. Um, but other than that, I really don't know too much about her. So I wanted to go back and kind of watch older videos and kind of catch up. But I don't know why I got this thing to where I can watch it old, like for instance, Keeping Up With The Kardashians. Um, they got what? 15, 16 seasons or whatever, or just like Master Chef. I just started, I had rewatched all of those. So I started from the very first season, 
which was like in 2000 something, like 2005, six, I don't know, one of those. Um, and yeah, it, it was, I had watched, here's the thing. I like to start from the beginning of the show so I can like know when they be bringing like, like Master Chef when they bring back like, oh, winners and you know, just different things like that. Like I don't like to feel left out. <laughs> so with Kardashians, I had rewatched that like years ago. Um, to, so I can know, you know, what everybody be talking about, you know, what's going on. But with YouTube, I don't know, like sometimes I can't really just watch old videos. Like if it's older than about like a year or so, then I don't want to watch it. Even a year though. So it's like, I feel like I just got so much to catch up with for her life. But going back down her stuff, she only got something to go back to two years ago. So... And then it says she only got 114 videos. So I'm like, it's really not much that I'm missing because I mean, I know she got some kids, you know, like I know she loves self care, but I don't know, girl. And then like I'm pregnant. So I don't know, I may go ahead and go back and watch them so I can really like know what's going on in her life because me just starting here, stuff that she been posting two, three weeks ago, about a month ago, maybe I don't know what's going on. So yeah, and this is on 81%, so we almost done. Um, I'll probably go back later, but I am about to watch this new video since she got put about to put up her Christmas decor and stuff like that. Actually, I'm gonna let this video finish playing because I don't need to be really just locked into the video. I need some like background. I usually put on background noise, like the chill vibes chill like chill music with the cute little background aesthetics like the coffee shop so i can't find my airpods so i'm about to ding it because baby where they go i know they in plain sight I need Prince to stop moving. Somewhere over here. Now I know I put it over here, but I don't see it. Y'all, <laughs> I know you lie. Wow. All right, well, found my AirPods. Thank God for that ding. It's 9.04. I'm done editing my Love Me wig review. Um, it's uploading. It's only three gigabytes, so it should be done. It was saving. It should be done saving. Um, it don't have a time on it like other softwares. It's on 16%, so it shouldn't take longer than about 15, 20 minutes. But my food, my pork chops and potatoes are done. I have it on 345, really low, just to keep kind of slow cooking to get it real tender. I got my pot of water going for my macaroni. Um, I'm about to clean up my kitchen and then probably try to clean that up while that's saving and while this food is getting done. I'm probably going to edit the love, the clothing haul in my bed. <laughs> that's dangerous. But since I'm literally just listening to a 10 minute, let me turn her off because I can't talk to y'all while listening to her in my ear. <laughs> um, the wig review, I did that one first specifically because 
she usually pay me early but um because it 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 takes a little bit more than the clothing haul because the hair review i have to do a voice over most of the time so i had to use like my mic all of that and that's all in that room so when i edit this clothing haul i'm going to edit in my bedroom and like i said the clip is only 10 minutes all i got to do is listen to me talk for 10 minutes chop it down the you know you know edit it and then just overlay me trying on the clothes so it's easy so i can do that comfortably in there so when my macaroni stuff is cooking i'm about to clean these dishes and kind of straighten up my mom's birthday <sighs> excuse me it's tomorrow like i was saying so supposedly everybody's gonna come to my house and i'm gonna have to drive everybody down to pine bluff to go to the casino yeah didn't know that was happening i thought they were gonna thought my sister was gonna drive them and then i just go down there because i had originally planned to stay with bae anyways my camera about to die i already showed y'all my little messy apartment <laughs> right now so i'll probably show y'all the finished product cleaned and then yeah i don't know i may go ahead and end this vlog because i've been vlogging since tuesday and it's friday and tomorrow i'm, I'm gonna start a new vlog so Hope y'all enjoyed this. If I don't come back on here, please like this video, <laughs> comment, and subscribe. It helps me out a ton. Subscribe, girl or boy. We're almost to 30K. Like, come on now. And then after 30K, it'll be 50K. After 50K, it'll be 100K. I need that YouTube plaque. That is my ultimate goal on YouTube. I don't know if I ever said that before, but like my YouTube goal is to get the plaque. And I will have it in Jesus' name. And I will have it in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. So yeah, thanks for watching. <laughs>a package to package and I wanted to kind of show y'all because I mean this is my business so don't mind the bunny yeah <laughs> so my cousin ordered um 18 20 and 22 of our raw Vietnamese super cute super flowy you know I'm gonna have a Black Friday sale as well but it's gonna be for pre-order sale So cute. All right, so for a pickup, I don't do the box or anything like that. I literally just come over here and I get out the bag. I do have my packaging vendor list on sale. So that's what this is. And then that's where my lash is. Put them in their own bag. I'm about to have to order some more of these because my count is getting low. They look like only about 15, 20 left. Get my baggies. <coughs> I have the little hairnet, but they're not like the big ones. I need to get like the extra long ones because these are kind of like for like your actual hair. Like if I was to put this on under this bunny, like lunch lady hairnets, that's what that is for. Then I write on here. Eighteen. What she get?
than I could be. Kim K and Kanye crazy, just man constant crazy with my leg. You got something that I'm interested in. Just man, you're 22. Tú atajando, que lo van a hando yo. Por más lo pon, you baby, you're 22. Tú atajando, que lo van a hando yo. Por más lo pon, you baby, 22 going on, 23. You look pretty, yeah, when you're fucking with me. I'm in your city, I'ma show you what I mean.